in this video, we are going to convert ChatGPT into a software. What up guys, welcome once again to Inflow. My name is Michael Amo and in this video, we are going to convert ChatGPT into a software. If you are here, I would assume you already know about ChatGPT, right? And I would also assume that you know that ChatGPT is a web application and that to access it, you would have to open it in the web browser, which means that in order to get onto ChatGPT, you'd have to open your browser, type in ChatGPT in maybe Google and then click on it and then from one stage to another before you are finally onto the page. But in this process, we are going to convert this website into somewhat like an application that you normally use on your PC and then just by clicking on it, it opens and then you can search for what you want to search for. We are going to do it on both Windows and Mac OS. So stay tuned. On Windows, we are going to use a website called Web Catalog. While on Mac, we are going to use a website called Fluid. Click on Create Custom App. Give it a name. I'll just name it CC. Copy and paste the URL here. And click on install as you can see it says CC is installed successfully you can open it it's also on the desktop So you can also double click it from the desktop. Can web catalog collect anonymous errors and crash reports? Say allow. It says I should verify that I am a human. You will be asked to log in or sign up. Because I am already logged in, I'm going to click on log in. After logging in, the app will be ready for use. Open the Fluid application. Search for ChatGPT on Google. Click on the first link. Copy the URL. Copy the URL and paste it here. Give it a name. I'll say CC. Give it a location, I'm going to maintain the desktop. Give it an icon, I will maintain the default icon. Click on create. Now as you can see, the app has been created. Click on OK. Double click on it. It says charge GPT is at capacity right now. I'll close it again and try opening it once more. It will say login. I'll click on login. Click on continue with Google. Because I have already signed up. Sign up if you haven't signed up. Dada! We have been logged in. So now we can close it and open it once more.
whenever we open it as you can see the app will be always on chat gpt so i can search for how to sleep at night click on enter as you can see now it is working perfectly now i want it to show in my lunch bar so i'm going to copy it into my applications folder so that when i open my lunch bar it will be showing here so i can just open the lunch pad click on it now i can use it i will also be making a video on how to convert chat gpt into an android application thank you guys for watching this video see you guys in the next video